Oh, hello everyone. Sorry, the audio cut out rather unexpectedly there. Uh, welcome everyone to another Free Game Friday, where I check out what the latest Epic Game Store free game is. Uh, my name is Dizzy, and today we are jumping in to a little game called Doors Paradox. I'm not quite sure if it is Doors Paradox or Doors Colon Paradox or possibly Doors M Dash paradox but it's one of them there are doors and there are paradoxes <laughs> that's the that's the the gist for today uh it looks like it's sort of a small little puzzle gamey type thing might be quite sweet uh let me see if i can get it on your screens there we go that sort of looks like something that's on the screen doesn't it um yeah and it has a kitty cat on the title screen which is obviously the most important thing um Artie says these paradoxical doors have a colon. Well, that's the thing. They have a colon in the they have a colon in the game category on Twitch. The 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 Epic Game Store I think has a, an M dash, and then obviously here it's just doors paradox. Anyway, uh, we're going to jump in. We've got settings. They're not as as settings menus go. It's it's a little lackluster. Um, but it's probably fine. Alright, I have zero idea what the, the plan is for, for these these uh, things. So, we'll be finding out. First steps. Tutorial. Hello, it's the door. Click on the flower. Okay. Rotate the pot. Sure. Oh, there's a thing. Take object. Hook. Okay, right click to zoom out. Now swipe to look around. Take the door knob. Put on door, I'm guessing. There's something shiny back there as well. Look around on your own, hang on. Gem collected. Oh, okay. I guess that's like a little bonus. Look around on your own. Does doorknob go on door? Do I drag door to, to doorknob? No, I do not. Can I pull on... Pull the rope, okay. Ah, we have a king girl in the chat. Welcome, how's it going? Uh, I don't know if I actually said hi to everyone out loud, but we have a Boom Boom and an Artemis as well. Um, Artie says, what doors need of the digestive tract? I'll never know. <laughs> pull the rope. Oh. That was very rude. Click on the broken vase. Move the vase piece. Find key. Okay. Sure. Swipe the lock. Pull down? No? Just, okay, just click. Clover. And... Oh. That's a disturbing thing to read. <laughs> Dear me, you've been in a bad accident. Please follow me. Oh, good. Okay. <laughs> right, so it's a, it's a we're in a coma plot. Sure. King girl, it's doing okay. Are you less EP today? I'm a little less EP today. Uh, I woke up and I went to get washed uh, in the morning, as one does. And I... Uh... Opened the... I opened the... No, hang on. Shut up. Let's see. I'm thinking about the game. I got my... Got, got everything ready to have a wash. Fill the, fill the sink with soapy water. Flannel in soapy water. And then hung up the flannel without using it. And proceeded to towel off my completely bone-dry body. Uh, <laughs> so that, that, that took... That took two attempts. So I'm not that much less easy than previously. Okay, twiddle this. I see. Uh huh. Another gem and another hook. Right. And we've got this. Does the doorknob go on that? No. Does a hook go on that? No. Okay. Hmm. Oh, the clover goes on here, does it? 
Oh, okay, I can see how that fits. Sure. Ah, hooks. Yes, of course. Oh, she says that it's very EP behavior. Yep. And then we've... Oh! We've opened the door? Click the door to open it. Ah, oh, kitty! Hello! Oh, and a tunnel. Da da da! And, and that's puzzling. There we go. Okay, so, so point and click, interact objects in strange combinations, uh, as one sort of expects. Uh, we have a Shesko in the chat. Welcome. How's it going? I like these scenes. These scenes are very pretty. The game reminds me a lot of... Um... Oh, gosh. What was it called? I'm going to have to open my Steam library just quickly to check what it's called. Um... Okay, right. Oh, 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 oh. Game's very unhappy. Kachunk. Right. Oh god, the game is fairly unhappy with me today. It, it keeps um tabbing out just sort of randomly. Hello, game. <laughs> Give me a second. Um <clears throat> Doo -doo -doo. I think it objects to having Steam open. <laughs> Tesco is also feeling a little tired. A couple of days have been a bit frantic, We're constantly jumping from one thing to another. Oh dear. Well, make sure to take a... Oh. Yeet. I, I think that's going to be the fate of a lot of flower pots in this game somehow. <laughs> oh dear. Alright, is there a lever on the other side? There is a lever on the other side. Ka-chunk. Alright, this one I think just opens. Nice to breathe, it'll enjoy your stream. Aw, oh, shucks, Shaskor. Okay. And then... Oh, that looks like something that this might go in. Oh, okay, that's not what I expected that to do. I guess I could have just opened this. We've got a ring and a ring. This does not look much like a ring to me, but okay. What else have we got? This thing up here, we apparently can't interact with. We've got a crowbar. Crowbars, I think, are pretty useful for opening doors. Another scroll. I'm a messenger of chaos, and I mean you no harm. Well, that does sound like a me who would be in a coma. Okay. I'm assuming I can't just crowbar open the door. No. Can I have a look at these wheels? Oh, yes I can! Nothing on the other one. <laughs> if cats could write. Okay. Um, oh, maybe we can open this? We can open this, but I have no real idea what this is. Ah, okay, I guess we're looking for another two rings somewhere to finish that off. And maybe we can... Crew. Hello. Excuse you. Maybe we can open some crates with a crowbar? There we go, ring number three. Oh, okay, we only need three. Cool. What does that what does that do? Oh, we need to line up. Ah. Okay. That's fine. That is now lined up. Can we open it now? Oh, we need to line it up with this thing at the bottom, don't we? Okay. There we go. Ah, oh, and we have a gloves as well. How's it going? Key. Keys open. Doors. Wonderful. I'm pretty sure we got both of the gems. I'm not going to obsess over the gems, but I will find them if I can. Ah, 
This is cute. I like this. I think it's going to have exactly zero replay value, but it's currently a free game, so, you know. <laughs> Why not? Gloves. Just woke up. You feel like microwaved cabbage right now. Oh, dear. Interesting. Okay, we have a big old tree. Um, we've got a gem down here, just sitting out in the open for us. Thank you. And that, which I didn't even mean to pick up. Ah, okay. Is this some sort of a balancing puzzle? There's also, uh, Amy Rose's hammer. <laughs> There's a scroll. Hello. You were once little and carefree, full of unlimited potential. Doesn't sound like me. We got an empty bucket as well, okay. So the bucket presumably goes on the well. No? The bucket does not go on the well. Interesting. Do I need to lower it down a bit first? I guess I need something to attach it to the well, possibly. Can I pick up this one as well? Oh. Oh. Interesting. Okay, so these are... I can set the amount of water in them, I guess. I'm sure I... No, okay, I can put that there. Wonderful. Okay. Hmm. Can I push this back down? No, okay, once it's up, it's up forever. Interesting. There's nothing in these? No. Alright. I need next puzzle piece. I'm not certain what next puzzle piece might be. That's as far as we can spin that, and it doesn't do anything. Hammer. Oh, can we use the hammer on the vases? Yay, vandalism! Can I break the other one? Yeah, it has a gem in it. There we go. Okay, so now the hook goes on there, and then the bucket goes on the hook. Now we have a bucket with water. Okay, and now we need to figure out what... Oh, look, it tells us what levels we need. So we need this one... Down to there. And we need this one... Uh, there. Oh, actually, I could probably put the water in. Oh, really? It fills back up? Rude. Oh, okay. This is... That is not how I expected that to work, but okay. Sure. And luckily, one bucket has enough for both. If we could chunk that to there. Ah, uh, Then we've done it to the wrong level. There we go. <laughs> I guess so, Shasko? <laughs> cylinder. Thank you, um, Cthulhu, for, for giving me this cylinder. Which I assume has something to do with this. Maybe it goes in here. Oh, and I need to set it to match this, I'm guessing. So we need green at the top. We need green and then red, and then blue, which we have. Okay. This... Uh... Oh, okay, right. We don't rotate the middle bit, we rotate the outer bits. Hang on. Green needs to be at the top, okay. No? Can we do that, please? Thank you.
Wonderful. <laughs> Thank you, Boom Boom, for adding that as a quote. Also, I'm going to possibly spend the next few streams uh, occasionally getting you confused with Shaskul because I just realized you're the same color, but it's fine. Um... <laughs> oh, my goodness. Thank you for giving me the silver. It sounds, it sounds much worse out of context. <laughs> much worse. All right, what do we got? Oh, we can see down this one. Hello. There's the cat. Hello, kitty cat. Hey. Um, right, getting distracted. Oh. Green pot and some wood. Interesting. What's this? It's got some matches and a gem in it. I'm still not sure what it is, but it has those things. Boom Boom is a master of many colours. Um, like Saruman. Your problems came with the sunset of your childhood. Oh no, this is, this is another game that's going to psychoanalyze me. Oh no. Can I take any other wood? No, okay. Anything up at the top here? No. Oh, okay. I'm assuming this is where the green pot goes. Oh, that hasn't helped me at all. <laughs> All right. I assume we're going to use. We're going to split this wood. Oh, do I need to take the axe first? Put the wood on the block. Put the axe back. Chop. Also, yank that while we're here. Chopped wood. Open door. Put wood in. Put matches in. Grab gem that's just sitting there. Wait, hey, come back, I want the gem! Oi! 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 Let me in! Let me in! I need that, thank you. Okay, what has that... What has that done for us? Answer... I have no idea. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. Right, I need to I need to No, I need to do this one first. Hang on. Uh put you there. You there. Yoink. Dip down. Dip dip. Nope, I need to do this one next. Dip hip. There we go. Jessica says, I'm not 100% sure that's how turbines work. I didn't get a good look, actually, at how it was working. Um... I think it might turn. Maybe. I don't think it would be very efficient. I think it might turn. <laughs> Artie says it's not the most efficient it would work. They are slightly offset, you couldn't tell that from the side. No, I I, I wasn't sure about that either. Alright, if we put you in the middle like that then Oh oh okay no we don't do that. Hang on. Gotta do these two first. This is an interesting puzzle. I like it. Um, we do this one. We put that. Oh, um, gosh. Okay, that was tricky. That was real tricky. Okay, and now we have the combination. So you need to be at. Down one and then up two. So down, oh, okay, down one and up two. And you need to be at down one and up one. Down one and up one. Amazing! We did it! 
Hi, kitty. Kitty, you have many strange dolls. Alright, gears and engines. Sounds like my kind of door. Ah, we have a curly turnips. How's it going? I can't believe you would say such lewd things in my chat. As you grow older, things started changing. All right, I was really interested in the in the cat premise for all of like two levels. <laughs> um, okay, we're going to need a combination for this combination lock. We've got a game of solitaire there, which oh, I guess we need to actually solve this, solve this, don't we? Okay. Nope, that one. There we go. Okay. Sure. Uh, these three are now correct. That might have been a bad idea. That might have been a bad idea. We'll work on it. Next, brown. Nope, brown. There we go. Then orange. Amazing. Oh. Light bulb and gem. Okay, so it's relatively difficult to go through these levels without picking up both of the gems. Right. Oh, look, there's something stuck in the gears. I can get rid of that, can't I? Oh, I just evaporated it. All right. So what have we got? We've got a drive belt. Or possibly a band. Okay. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. I spy with my little eye. Oh, another light bulb and another gem. And we have a schematic. And we need to put the wheel on and I need to put the band on the wheel. Sure. I probably need to put the other two light bulbs in. Why it needs five light bulbs? I have no idea. Oh, it needs five light bulbs to show that it's illuminated the whole way. Oh, oh, I think I think we might have overcharged that just slightly. Okay. Now, oh, ah, oh, the light illuminates a code two, three, six, four. Boop. Phenomen phenomenal. It's giving me two square keys. Oh, wait, no, it's giving me one square key and one triangle key. Do I need to drag this? Oh, I do need to drag this. Okay, hang on. Alright, that one felt pretty quick. Kitty's there again. Hello. <laughs> oh, Shasko, oh no. <laughs> um. Alright, camera obscure. I have no idea how many of these are of the, these there are, by the way. Uh quite a lot. Twenty-two in this area, and then there's, I guess, two more chapters. Probably, I'm I'm guessing probably of eighteen because it's going to be sixteen base, and then all the blues and all the reds, and again here. That should keep us going for quite a while. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. <clears throat> where are we? Camera obscura. I have no idea what that joke means, I'm afraid, Chesco. Possibly because I am not an animator or a collaborator. Um, 
Alright, we have alphabet blocks here along the sides. A, B, C, D. Okay. And the doorknob goes into different holes. Ooh. Right. These turn, but not yet. Gotcha. This looks like a funnel into which we can pour water. Oh, and flush out a ninja throwing star. Okay. I'm gonna scroll down here. Engineering school was a wedge that separated you from your friends. Oh. Okay. Right. Okay, it's a it's a swapsies puzzle. Okay. No. That one. Okay. Just it's typically called a doors collab or collaborate. Oh, hang on, wait. Sometimes a lot of animators will make one small animation each of a character entering through one door and leaving through another. Those animations are chained together into a series. I see. Okay. Uh, right. Ah, we need to get rid of the old gear and put on a new gear. Then we need to figure out how to turn it on, I'm guessing. We also probably could do with figuring out where this little star thing goes. Oh, it goes in the star at the top. I don't know what I expected to happen, but it wasn't that. Okay. I don't really know what that means. Steam man. <laughs> uh, can we okay, can we do this now? No, still no. Wait, do I need this to be hit? Ah, okay, right. Okay, so that's what this is. That's what that is, but I still I don't know what the combination is. Can I turn this? Oh, that turns that. If I turn this, can I open the sides? No. No, okay. Clicking. Oh! Oh, I clicked on that by mistake. Hello, pretty gem. It'd be nice if I could see camera reel. It'd be nice if I could see, uh... Where's the camera? Oh, the camera goes in the top, I guess? If I could see whether I've picked up the, the various gems. Okay. Okay, and then this... So this tells me that for A, I need the fourth one. Which is... So A needs to be Xbox. Right. And then B... We need the second one, which is uh, lots of stripes. Oh, sorry. For C, I need the third one, which is one dot. For D, I need the first one, which is uh, on the Drex. Okay, we did it. Did I get both gems, do we think? Or did I miss one? Uh, oh, we have a transvite. How's it going? Twitch heard you say Xbox and gave you a PlayStation ad. Oh, no, that's score. Oh, dear. Um, hmm. I guess we'll never know if we found the red gem or not. 
are, but there's bonus levels locked behind the red gems. No, oh, okay, I did find the red gem. Fantastic. <laughs> Phenomenal. <laughs> are you collaborating with the advertisers, Chance Rights? Okay, we've got that thing, which is apparently a sprocket. We've got a bucket collecting steam. Oh, that sounds bad. Oh, it only goes one way. Okay, I'm sure that's fine. Valve. Okie doke. Right, we've got another scroll. You turned into a shadow of your former self, blind to the beauty in the world. Have you ever met an engineer? Really? This doesn't go on here? Are you sure? Oh, there's the other gem. Are you sure you're sure that doesn't go on there? Maybe it goes on here. Okay, there we go. We've got another sprocket. Oh, this... That's good news. I'm sure that's definitely supposed to be in the red. I think we're going to blow this door off its damn hinges. Oh, there's like a little astrolady type thing going on down there. Um, okie doke. So I need... Uh, I can't put... I'm guessing the sprockets go on there. I can't put those on there yet. Do I just put a bolt on here? Okay. Sure, if in doubt, just, just, just bung up the pressure by shoving any old thing in the hole. Sure. <laughs> if you blow off the door, it's technically open. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Now I need to... So C needs to go into 1, A2, and B3. Oh. Oh, okay. This is complicated stuff, isn't it? Um... Okay. That pretty much has to be like that. So that pretty much has to be like that, and that has to be like that. This has to go that way, this has to go that way, and then that has to go that way. Okay. I d honestly didn't even bother checking if those were going to the right ones, and I just kind of assumed, because there wasn't really any, like, degrees of freedom to make decisions. That's an interesting method of powering something. <laughs> Arcing plasma. Alright. And sprocket. No? Is this a specific one? Oh, oh, there's a door. Lol. Oh, I can't close the door again? Oh dear, hang on, okay. This one needs to be pointing left. That one needs to be pointing right. And that one needs to be pointing down right. Did I, did I do it right? I mean they're all they're all pointing. Okay, I just needed to I was supposed to align them after I closed the door again. There we go. Kitty cat acquired. Oh you're like a shadow kitty cat. You're like a little bit translucent. My fun is not doing well on my little windowsill here. Hmm. Probably because it keeps getting battered by my curtains. 
isn't something I really have the ability to fix. Hmm. Uh, anyway. Uh, do, 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 do. Deep distress. Noted. So, this is a water themed one, I guess? Oh, oh, there's a flashing red emergency light. We don't like that. Water is pouring into this little sort of bucket thing. Alright, let's look inside the dive helmet. The boating incident was a brief wake up call. Oh, we can't look inside this little diving helmet because I guess it needs something on here. Okay. I can't re I need to wipe that off, I think, to see. This is locked in place. And there's a little. Oh! Okay, I'm gonna need to make a shape with that, I guess. Okay, this doesn't do anything. We found lots of parts that don't do anything. Right, phenomenal. Can I... okay. <laughs> I'm slightly lost as to where I need to start. Oh look, I, I assume if I turn this... Yeah, it, it rotates that. But what I don't know is is why I would need to do that. <laughs> um, the pod bay doors, Hal. I can't let you do that, Dis. Glove says start with the nut. Do you mean this one? I don't think I can interact with this. If you mean another nut, then I don't think I've seen it. Possibly because I am blind. <laughs> Trance rights. Relinking pipe. Oh! I was looking around for a bit. I was thinking I was going to have to put a bit on there. Oh, that's so clever. Oh, that's so clever. All right. We've 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 dropped the bathtub walls. And we've got a key and a gem. And... Oh... Right. Okay. Right, we need a key to unlock that. And grab a screwdriver. Then we need a blue key to get in there. Um screwdriver maybe can unscrew this? Doesn't look screwed on, does it? Maybe we need the screwdriver for the green screw. It's green screwdriver, green screw. It it confused me slightly because the screw is Philip's head, and the the screwdriver is not. Ah, right, and that's the shape we need. Uh, right, we need to go all across the middle and then make it into like a little table. Okay, all across the middle, make it into a little table. Oh, that only undid one of them! That's no good. Okay, does this do stuff now? Oh! Oh, okay, I can change that. Right. Interesting. Right, okay, so we don't quite know how to do that yet. I need to, like, decrease the sensitivity. I also haven't figured out what this button does, either. That's fine. 
Um. Okay. What did we actually unlock when we did this? I have forgotten already. I have completely forgotten what we unlocked when we did that. It doesn't seem to have given us anything. Oh, we unlocked one of the things on this. Okay, that's fine. It's not helpful. Is that a button on top? No, well, I guess we can't click that. Uh, oh, we have a Jasmine in the chat. Welcome, how's it going? Um, I'm not super sure what I'm doing currently. This is so dirty. Can I not clean this in any way, shape or form? I need a cloth. This this is attached to this, so I guess I need to do something to this to get this to work. But I don't know what I need to do to this. Cause Oh I didn't think that button did anything. Never mind. Okay, right, we can now see. Maybe. Oh my god. <laughs> we can't really see, can we? Blimey. I think it's a triangle with the top corner colour. An upside down triangle with a top corner coloured in. There we go. Jessica says next puzzles to get a screen wipe. Um, honestly, I was exactly expecting that to be a thing. Okay. Can I flick this lever back off? No, I cannot. Now I've got to figure out what we're doing with this. So I don't have a key. I don't... Oh, there's the key. Oh. I can literally just take it off. <laughs> I was like, oh, look, it's connected by some like cords and stuff. I'm going to have to open this up and do stuff with it. Nope. Numpty. Wrench. Jam. I assume wrenches for this. Red wrench for red thing. Oh, there we go. Uh... <laughs> That's the cleaning cloth. That's the cleaning cloth for this. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, we already did it without. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Oh dear. Um. All right. So. So now what do we do? The only thing left that moves is this. Do I need to get this all pointing in the same way? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, can I see a combination through this? I can just look out into the endless void. I don't think that helps me, though. I don't think I can make this into a shape that matches uh, any combination of this. It just says, do the cylinders move when you rotated those? Which cylinders? The cylinders behind them? 
Oh. Oh. Oh, this is not the kind of puzzle I thought it was. Okay. Sure. Thank you, Shaskor. Again, much, much brighter than me solving this. Right, we've got a medium sized uh, right way up triangle and the little upside down triangle. Phenomenal. Hello, kitty. There are barely five pixels moving at the bottom. I can't fault you for missing it. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, oh, dear. All right. Golden Gate. Ooh. We have a, a orientally type themed one. Got a very pretty backdrop. Okay, what have we got? Some things what need moving into place? No, I need to add something to them to be moved into place. Okay. We've got a gem lying around waiting to be nabbed. We've got another gem just lying around waiting to be nabbed. How unusually considerate. We have a combination lock with Oh a little a little pressure plate underneath. These will really hurt your feet if you step on them. There's a key at the top here, a keyhole at the top here. Candle. Okay, okay, and then we've got this. Later, your trip to the east filled you with inspiration. Oh god, I'm that kind of person, oh no. Right, what do we have to do here? Okay, I can't seem to move that bit. This I can't move. I guess I need to put that on top of that. Okay. Right. I understand, I think. Maybe. But also maybe not. Oh, this is a tricky one. Okay. Just says, did they really just, I'm on the journey of enlightenment to the east you? I think they did, yes. Hmm. I've never been very good at these sliding type puzzles. Um, no, as you can see, very not good at them. Hmm. Um. Hmm. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Uh. Oh, my brain is, it doesn't work with these. It's very tragic, I know, but it doesn't. Um, hmm. 
Hmm. Oh, hello. I found a symbol. Interesting. That doesn't help me solve this. Is anyone in chat good at these, this kind of puzzle? Because I'm really bad at this kind of puzzle. It needs, like, spatial reasoning skills that I don't really have. Jessica says, I think you're onto something earlier, I'm not sure. This kind of looks promising. No, go back one. No, don't go back one. This was nearly it. This was close to being it. Um, Jasmine says, I got my priority straight on this PC. <laughs> Discord and Steam, a second and third. Hmm. Ugh. Mm. Okay. Jessica says, I think if the tall one on the lower right replaced by two, two small ones. Oh, okay. And then I'd already shuffled it by the time you said that. Yeah, I, I'm just, I've always been bad at these because I, I don't know how to get a thing to where I want it to be. Particularly. Ah, that that this looks promising. Okay, we 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 just basically tried everything. <laughs> oh, we got a shiny. Fire diamonds. Oh, okay, drama queen. All right. Candle, fire diamond. Could you not have actual fire in your video game? Key. Keyhole. Okay. Ah, oh, we've got a blue dot. Blue ball. Okay. I assume this goes in here. Ka-ching. That says one, two. Okay. Does the symbol go on here? I'm not sure. That's half the puzzle. Um, just says, aren't diamonds combustible? Yes, yes they are, because they're carbon. Translate says everything is combustible if you try hard enough, which I don't think is true. I've been given the numbers 1, 2, but I don't know what they mean. I don't think they're for this. I don't think this has normal numbers on it. Normal numbers, they say. What a fucking British thing to say. Uh, apologies. Um, okay, so I need to find something else to do anything with. <laughs> uh... What if I set all of the combinations to this symbol? 
It seems unlikely, because these are things that I, I put in places. I need to find somewhere to put it. Can I stick it on the outside of one of these? No, okay. Hmm. Uh, Shaskor, you probably just have to put it in pure oxygen, that usually helps. If it doesn't, add some fluorine. That's because apparently diamonds need 850 C to burn. That's, that's a lot of Cs. Um, hmm. I've kind of run out of moving parts. I don't know where to go to get a green ball. I'm assuming it must be in this, but I do not know what the secret of this thing is. I can't interact back with that thing again. I can't... Oh! Hello! Violet Diamond. Can I pull off all of these? Yes, okay. Ah, oh, okay, right. There we go. They're a little finicky to, to actually pull off. Right, and then these go on here. And that looks like a spot for a symbol. Which gives me a green ball. So then plop in there. Chunk, 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 chunk. Chunk, 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 chunk. Oh, yeah. Three, one, two, four. That's a combination. Unfortunately. I don't speak this to know which number is which. Am I to assume that these are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10? Maybe. So 3 is this sort of little house with a, a level in the middle. Oh, bother. I'm going to just skip past that. Okay. One. Oh no, it's telling me. It's telling me the position of the symbols. Okay, so symbol number one is on the right of position two. So that's this sort of a uh, triangle ish shape. There we go, right. And then number two is the one directly below that which is this other house, which is the one it actually already is. And then number three is this one at the top, which is the two characters next to each other. Like that. And number four is one up from the bottom on the left, which is this... Uh... Oh, I bloody clicked that, didn't I? No? No? That's not the combination? Oh no. <laughs> oh no, okay. Did I read the instructions wrong? Um, hmm, okay. Do I need to? Is this is the one on the left actually supposed to be this door? In which case, it would be. 
uh, number one, oh, oh, I've tabbed out again by mistake, would be this symbol. And then the one underneath it, which is the other house. And then three and four would be three and four. So we've got sort of pick the table. And then box with two. Oh, for God's sake, Dizzy, every time. I, I don't even know what I'm looking for anymore. That one, and then this symbol right here. Okay. Amazing. They just had it the wrong way around. That's fine. That was that was a lot trickier than than. But there's a there's been a sudden escalation of difficulty in the last two puzzles. <laughs> we might be rapidly approaching the limits of dizzy brain power. Just so you'll know. Red lantern. Okay. So we're still in the east. Capital T, capital E. Right, here's our next scroll of psychoanalysis. For a while there, you were getting control of your life again. By stealing everyone's pretty gems. Okay, an interesting... Oh no, I have to play a game? I think I've done the game wrong. Oh no, oh double no. Oh, this is evil. Oh, this is horrible. I have no idea how to do this. Ha <laughs> ha. The green ones can only move forward. The blue ones can only move backwards. Um. That I I have to surely start with that, and from here there's only two possible moves. Um, okay, we've never got this far before, which is good. I don't see how to progress from here, though, which is bad. No, we've scuffed it. We were close that time. Nope, we scuffed it then. Nope, we scuffed that as well. Oh, this is so hard! Just because I'm getting flashbacks to Chinese checkers? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Which isn't Chinese. No, it's German, isn't it? Um. Okay. Maybe? Yes! Okay! We did it! We just tried everything. Okay, what have we got here? Things spinning that I guess need gears to have on them. Sure. Oh, there's a gem here. Hello. And a key? Indeed. The gems are nice because the gems sort of let you know that, uh... Like, there's something there to, to find, often. But, I get distracted and I go for the... I go for the gem and then ignore whatever else is there. I get I get shiny tunnel vision. Um, 
Right. I'm assuming I can't just push down on these. No, okay. What's this? There's something. Maybe that's where the key was, possibly. Is there another key behind this? There we go, okay. This is back to Corvid. <laughs> um Right. Okay. I don't exactly understand. Ah, okay, right. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, I see what I gotta do. I think. Um so I have to I have to hold one. No, hang on. I have to I have to get it so that um one of them's in place and one of them's like the correct amount of out of sync. I think. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. This is a little bit brain, unfortunately. There we go, that's what I was after. Okay, we did it. And we got a gear. Sorry, we got a cog. Which goes on there. Chunk chunks. We got our two little liney boys. Can I take the liney boys? Oh, and they go on these plinths. Dip, dip. Well, that just leaves me with the actual door. Oh, that one was like not even really locked. Come on, kitty. In we go. Amazing. All right, Asian fall. Oh no. What have we got here? There's like a hook on me underneath that. I can't zoom in on it. We've got a shiny. We're gonna need to, I guess, put some water in here. Oh, okay. That gives us a tile. Sure. Can we put the tile on the trays? No. Oh, okay. That's, that's not what I clicked on. Tile goes in the tile puzzle. I see. Oh, no. It's one of these again. Oh, no. Right, that's two of them in the right place. We know that one goes up there. Okay, Translate says, I hope you're inspired by your journey to the east. Oh no, at least all the tiles are the same size. Yes, that is a small bonus. Okay, I 
think uh also luckily there's like loads of room on this one which is nice uh -huh. so it means i can do stuff like that right Um, I need to figure out the order that these go in, which is that order. Oh, and then you need to be there or there. No, you need to come down and be there. Hang on a sec. Like that. Is this one in the right place? No, this is a corner one. Sorry, this is a side one. Um, I really hope that goes there. It didn't go there. Oh no. Oh, what have I done? Oh, dizzy. Oh no. Amazing. Okay, we did it. Glove says, makes me want to play Mahjong again. My old Morris side had like a, a, a Mahjonging subgroup of people, and I never, ever, ever understood the appeal. What has this given us? <laughs> I have no idea what to do with this. I've got no moving parts. I don't seem to have anywhere that I can pick up parts. I can't click on the top. There's nothing else in here, I assume. I can make it overflow, maybe. Transfract says, which Mahjong? The tar matching one or the seedy back room filled with cigar smoke one? I must admit, I sort of thought they were the same one. So I don't know. What do I do with you? Hmm. These are like tied to this. I need to I need to find something to pick up and put on these. But what I've been given instead is this thing that I can't interact with. Hmm. And everything I click on just takes me back to these two instances, neither of which I want. I can't untie these, can I? No. Uh, file one was super chill. Yeah, I have no idea which one it is, uh, or it was. Oh, okay, I can click up here, it just didn't want me to. Thanks, game. Knowledge and wisdom filled your soul. Okay. Right, what has that done for me? I guess I need something to hook on there. I can't take this bell off, so maybe that was the wrong one to put the weight on. There is something that can get put on a hook. A hammer? Oh, okay, to strike the bell with. Okay, sure.
Obviously, what else would happen when you struck a, a bell? <laughs> huh. Chacha says, there's the solitaire thing. There's the one where you pawn someone's Richie until they Dora, presumably not the Explorer. Okay, phenomenal. Can I go through the door from this side? No. Hey, kitty. Time to go. I did, didn't like that one that much. <laughs> the balance. We're really going hard on the ancient Eastern wisdom thing, aren't we? Why did we have one level of... Like, interesting gears. And... Four levels of... Random Orientalism. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can line up all the light green ones. Because I think there's only one set of light green ones. No, okay. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, I don't know what we're doing with that yet. We've got this thing up here. Which I... Oh, okay. Tile matching! Okay, that was over here somewhere, not that. Luckily it doesn't make you reset the whole thing. That one? Yep, and that one there. Okie doke. Okay, and then there's something else to do on this side. More tiles. Is it the same pattern? No. Oh, that was lucky. Wait, where was the other one of those? Hang on, I just saw it. Oh, there we go. I've just realized these... These two... Aren't the right... Aren't the... They're not the same way up. Like here, the big blobby is on the bottom. Here, the big blobby is on the on the outward face or the top. Oh, that's an interesting error to have made. All right. Okay. Uh, transfer says the latter one apparently Final Fantasy XIV has really good implementation to the point a bunch of Mahjong pros have made trial accounts just to play Mahjong on Final Fantasy XIV. Okay, we need a sword to cut the knot. Katana, obviously. Okay, and a tea set with an origami crane and. Something which doesn't help me at all, but I assume it's supposed to. Green, red, blue, pink? Okay, green. Red. Blue, pink. Right, and a hammer. Sorry, a mallet to strike the gong with. Here's the gong. Right. 
right. I don't think the key is for this, though. Don't know what this does yet. We could make a shape with it. Opens up the keyhole. That one was a lot easier than the last few. Did I get all the gems that time? I don't know if I did. Hey, kitty. Oh, I didn't get any of the gems that time. Where the hell are the gems? I know I said I wasn't going to stress about the gems, but here I am stressing about the gems. Oh, th there's one gem. Literally right in front of my face. Uh, where the hell is gem number two? Not in there, although I can zoom in on that for some reason. That's the scroll. We didn't even get the scroll. You always found it hard to find the balance in your life. Oh, God. Oh, I can move aside the cushions. There's gem number two. All right, we're going to have to quickly do this again. Um, I don't know if the patterns are the same. They might be. Where was that one? That one there. Up here somewhere. There we go. Uh, right. There. Then we've only got a few left. There we go. Speed running pairs by having something of a memory. Chop it open. I wonder if actually I could. Can I just do this? If I can remember it. It was green, blood, red, blue, pink, right? Amazing. We don't even we didn't even need to do all that stuff up there. We could just cheat. Speed running. Okay. I will say, I've seen a lot of doors so far in Doors Paradox. I've not seen a single paradox so far in Doors Paradox. Okay, okay. Royal Observatory. Ding, dang, ding, dong. Okay, one gem is just lying there. That's lovely. We've got lots of stuff up here. Okay. There's a sword down on the ground here next to the scroll. Ah, we have a Shaka in chat! Welcome! How's it going? Doors! Indeed doors! Cute little puzzle doors! It's reminding me of a game that I cannot for the life of me remember what it was called. I was going to look for it in my Steam library and I never got round to it because the game started having a panic. As you grew older, you started reaping what you've sown. What does that mean? Oh, we could just have all of the swords. Oh, yes please. Gem inside the clock. Key. Lens, I guess, for the telescope. Why it was on the front of a clock, we will never know. Okay. Oh, big gemstone. Oh, it's a, it's a thingy. What are they called? These, um, oh my god, what are they called? Orrery? Is it an orrery? I think it's an orrery. The most awesome possible thing to have. Doesn't ever like do anything useful, particularly. You never need it to know where the planets are. 
But it's really cool. Shaka is nearly home from uni. Well, that is just fantastic. Thank you so much for gracing us with your presence on your walk home. Okay. What does that do, though? It's got us some big gears rocking back and forth. Do I stick the lens on the telescope? This is definitely not how telescopes work. Ah, I gotta angle it. That's something. I assume. Question mark? I guess I need something to angle it at. Do I put the swords in here? Yes, I do. Okay. And I pointed at that. Well, that's really annoying. Uh, can I turn these at all? Do, are, the, are the different swords different? Ah, okay, right. There we go, okay. Right, now the sun is glowy! See, this is cool! This is much cooler than all of the, the Orientalism nonsense. Oh, this one's not even locked! This one doesn't even have a catch, it just has a handle! It's a cool looking door as well, I'd have that door in my house. And once again we follow the kitty. Uh, Shax, what do you mean I use my all the time? <laughs> if I could find an orrery, that would be going straight on my throne. <laughs> Can you imagine? Um, oh my gosh. Velvet Burden. Okay, well, here's a gem. Oh, there's lots of gems. Okay, we picked up two diamonds. We're already rich. There's another gem behind this bottle of perfume. Wonderful. Here's another diamond. Ah, no, okay, this is where the diamonds go. Drown in complacence. You forgot about your inner child. Oh my god. What's this? Was the, was the, the, the script of these notes written by like a self help guy? Alright, wheel. Oh, what does this say up at the top? Zisphraxby. Well, that's where the wheel goes. Oh, we're gonna blow it up! Okay. And now we've got bigger diamonds. Okay, right, hang on, there's an order to this. Is this the... No, okay. I guess it's a combination of three that I need? Or a combination of four? Okay, right. We need to. We can't do that. We can't figure out from the interaction what the thing is. Oh. V1. V2. B. V. Z. A. B. V. Z. A. Okay. Sure. B. V. Said A. No, that didn't do anything. B V said A. So that did. B V said A. Okay, interesting. Why did that not work? Hmm. So what's going on with this this slot here? 
has like an asymmetrical bit of wood. Oh, weird. There's also a mirror here. Hello. Oh, okay. Wow. Really? Really? So, okay, so it's not BVZA. It is ZABV, I think. Okay. Z A B V. Rude. Very rude puzzle. And that gives me an element. They literally couldn't figure out what the hell this was, so this is an element. And then this we use to swap around bits. So you're going up there, and then in there, and then you're going there, and then you're going in there, uh, you're going in there, you're going in there, and you're going there. Wonderful. I think we got the gems. We'll find out. So how are we feeling about this? I've been doing it for an hour and a half. What's our, what's our thoughts? I think for a free game, it's fine. I'm not blown away by the puzzles. I, I highly doubt I'll be coming back to play this off stream ever. Oh, there's, there's a spike trap there. Interesting. We've got a a slot for an hour. Oh, excuse me. A slot for an hourglass and an hourglass and some schizos. Oh, and a scroll. You're the king of your own castle, but the castle is empty. What a what an empty thing to say. Um. Artie says, I already recommend someone for whom this kind of game is their jam. Fair enough. Okay, and we've got a thing. I can't play the thing. In fact, it looks like the strings are metal. I knew vandalism was going to be the answer. Sometimes you just look at something and you're like, I'm going to have to break that. Oh, we've got another hourglass. Interesting. And our second gem. Does that mean there's a slot on each side? There is a slot on each side. They must be interchangeable because they go into the same slot in the inventory. Oh no. Oh no, look at this! Oh, what a, what a meanie puzzle. I hate time limits in games. I don't know if I've ever mentioned that to you. Uh, thank you so much for doing a hydrate RT. Let me just uh, mute up quickly so I can get on that. My goodness. Uh, oh my god, my ears have gone. Hang on. Okie doke, so, twiddle that, and then, that pulls out those two. Wait, no, hang on, I had it a second ago, I could have done it if I clicked the right button. Damn it. That, 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 that. There we go. What is this? It's a time. Oh, that's... I'm going to have to adjust the clock, I guess. This clock, in fact. Okay, right. And then we're going to do this one. So, what are we thinking? Same... Nearly the same combo. We got that one first try. Okay, that's the time we need to get to. I'm assuming there's going to be a hand in here, and probably a hand somewhere else. Oh, no, we got both hands. That's lucky. lucky. Okay. So, small hand is pointing to a bit before 10. A 
big hand is pointing to a bit before six. How how precise a bit before ten do I have to be? Oh my god, the answer is very apparently. Does that does that work? Does that keep the spikes down? What are these things on each side of the door? What do they do? No matter. We found Kitty! Alright. The Guardian. This is like a European-y type castle. Okay. Have a look around. There's a gem down here. Along with two branding irons. Good, wonderful, loving where this is going. When your father called, you were busy, and now it is too late. Oh, our dad died. Okay, some sort of hexagon pattern. I'm going to fit some things in there. There's more things to fit in there. This is where these tools go. Okay, do I need to heat them up first? Heated tool. Ah, I see! We're making boiling oil! Transfer says, when you said you were bringing up the branding eyes, I was hoping for a more fancy one than square. <laughs> ah! Oh, is this boiling oil, or are we making, like, molten gold? We might be making something out of molten gold here. Possibly. Yeah, look, okay. I suppose it could be brass. Oh, okay. Right. Oh! Oh, this is a cool way of doing a, a, a moving parts puzzle. Oh, but you, can, you can't rotate these ones. Okay, I see. Hang on. Right. Oh... This is a tricky puzzle. I also can't remember what I'm trying to do. Um. No. <laughs> uh. <laughs> well. I'm trying to get the red ones on the right hand side, which is a bad start. Okay. Oh, hang on. Um, this is nearly right. It's just that this one's not quite in the right place. Right, if I do that, then we can figure out how to get that one back into place like this. That's a cool puzzle! Okay, and another sharp object. A knife. Um, we've only got one gem so far, right? Right? It's not lurking around the fireplace anywhere. What do we stab? Do we stab this? No. Do we stab you? No, we can't even click on you. Oh, I can fire the cannon though. I got the sneeze as well. Hang on.
Gosh, I am so sorry for, for that, my goodness. Alright, what do we stab? Do I stab the fire? Do I make a hot knife? No. Doing something with these chairs? Why do I zoom in on these chairs? Hmm. Concerning. What's this? Oh, that was where the, the banner nodes were, okay. What looks stabbable? This is the only thing that looks stabbable, and it's not stabbable. Can I move this? I can. Oh, I can tilt that as well. Oh. I'm not supposed to shoot the guy? Really? Maybe I don't have it. Maybe there's nothing in it. Maybe I need a cannonball. Um, is there any way I can interact with this? I'm gonna drag this onto there again, and it's not gonna do anything again. That's definitely pointing straight at him. I guess there's nothing in the cannon. Okay. I don't think I stabbed these slots, even though they look stabbable, because that's where the stuff came out. I've just realised we've got like a nice little castle background as well. Over over on the sides. It's like semi ruined? There's lots of outdoor seating. Um, right. Can I put knife in cannon? Load cannon with knife. Uh, can I cut up the seats? They've got, like, obvious stitching here. There we go. That's why I can zoom in on those. Gem. Marvellous. Ah, and this unlocks our cannonball dispenser, maybe? That looks like a cannonball dispenser to me. Right, and we get it, we're going to get it, the stamp back in case we miss. Phenomenal. Vandalism. Hey, kitty! Oh, the kitty was already running away by the time we got there this time. What shapes of browning irons were you hoping for, Transroids? I'm curious. I've been thinking about it since you said the message. <laughs> Do -do -do. Alright. Egyptian tomb. Looks like we're not finished being culturally insensitive yet. Just right. Okay, there's lots of stuff on the floor. There's a torch, which is currently unlit. After that, nothing can stop your search for wealth. Oh my god. Gem. Does this move? Ah, okay. It's a, it's a sparking device. Fill this thing with oil. Set fire to it. Set the torch on fire. Wonderful. Now what are we doing with that? Can I take these blocks? No, okay. Can I light these? Oh, hang on, I can zoom in on these. Yes, I can light those. And that lights up something in there. Does anyone know what that means? Can I spin this? I'm assuming I don't just put them all in. No. Do I have to do them in order? Screw square. 
zigzags gravestone. Uh, owl kitty cat. And then labyrinth, the last one. Oh, the guy! Just in the sand! Unusually careless of the ancient Egyptians, just leaving him in the sand like that. And he had a, a modern bolt and a bit of copper? Does the bolt go in there? Oh, okay. No, it's like a dial. Okay. Oh, no. I'm going to have to remember stuff. That's not good. I don't even know what I have to remember. Um. Got these eyes. Don't seem to be able to do anything with them. We've got the solution. I now need to find out what the. Ah, oh, okay, right. That's the puzzle. So. Uh, I need to go. I need to think about this like a number pad. I need to go one, five, four, one, five, four, eight, six. One, five, four, eight, six. I don't know if that's this guy giving us another diamonds. Lots of diamonds, all in a variety of pretty colours. And then this, this is uh seven five two six eight. Seven five two six eight. I'll have that as well. I assume we put these in the eyes. Hello! Oh, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, what a disaster. Okay, the good news is it's a tremendously easy one. I'm assuming it wasn't supposed to be that easy. But we did it anyway. <laughs> Dizzy and sliding block puzzles. Name a worse combination. Gosh, we're nearly at the end of chapter one. We've not done badly. Wise man's house. Kind of just looks like another bit of ancient Egypt to me. Alright, we've got a combination lock. Can I look at this bit on top? No, okay, apparently not. We've got a pot. Oh, we didn't break it this time, that's nice. Got some towels. With the combination to the lock. Okay. Uh, three, two, last one. Three, two, last one. That didn't do anything. Okay, that is the right combination. Maybe it's for something else. That's a button. Really? I can't push that? Are you sure? Are you sure I can't push that? It looks very pushable. Oh, for God's sake, it's one of the ones where they give you the combination and it's wrong! Greed consumed you and destroyed the future you were trying to build. Amazing. I feel so psychoanalyzed. Okay, replace the first one with the last one, sure. That's empty. Can't pull out these bolts. Okay. I guess I need to find something to go in there. Oh, look, there's a 
chest here. That means a key. Can I interact with the sofa? Pull the cushions off. Whee! Whoosh! Handle. And gem number one. Okay, is the handle for this? Yes. Open the chest. Grab a mask. Okay, the mask I guess goes on there. This is a key? Are you sure this is a key? Okay. I have to play a game of some sort. Whatever I just did, I can't undo. And I can't... okay. Do you not quite understand how the game works? Oh, okay, I can slide in any direction, but I the the two red bubbles can never touch. Okay, sure, gotcha. Uh Transfight says, speaking of feeling psychoanalyzed, have you played the Telus Principle before? I have not played the Telus Principle. I did see Fion playing it. I could put these two things together. I'm assuming that I need to to fill this up, but I I don't know how to get this these red balls off of off of this because I I can't put these both down there. Hmm. Unless I'm supposed to cover over the black ones. instead of, of complementing the black ones. Ah, oh, hang on. There we go, okay. Oh! Ancient Egyptian lightning! Wonderful. We've opened the pyramid, there's a smaller pyramid inside. Grand. So where the hell is the other key? Them. Or can I take this key off now? Nope. Okay. So, key number two. Also gem number two. Why is this bottle here? Hmm. Wait, can I flick the switch? I can flick the switch and get the key back. Okay, so, only one key. Um... Transfer says Fionn refused to interact with the beep boop though. <laughs> okay, right. Why can this. Okay, where am I trying to get to? Phenomenal. Okay. It's given us a little green marble. Which goes in here and unlocks the door. Okay, door is unlocked. But we never found the red gem, did we? So where's that going? Can't pop this, the key off this time, okay. It's not under the seat. No, it's not in the box. Little red gem, where do you be? <clears throat> hmm. See, I need a I need a tracker to make sure that I have actually not got the little red gem. I can still show a hint if I want to. That kind of feels like cheating though. Okay, I 
definitely can't pop this back off. Where is the gem? Could it be in the sand somewhere? Seems unlikely. Hmm. There's nothing else here to interact with. Nothing here to interact with. I definitely can't smash this bottle in any way, shape or form. Anything to these chairs. Why the hell is the red gem? If that's the only red gem I miss, I'm gonna be really annoyed. It's the thing. Hmm. Okay, we can't get a hint for the red gem. The only hint that was left was, I guess, open the door, you dumb idiot. Joshua says, time to unleash the fire and smash everything until the puzzle provides the gem. Oh, we did find the gem! I just don't remember finding the gem. Oh, an Arabic market. Do we think this will be handled sensitively? <laughs> okay, gem. Get. Gem collected. Can I smash these? No, okay. No obvious sign of the other gem or the scroll. Okay, we've got a key there. We've got some sort of a combination here. We've got a box that I can't do anything with just yet. Can I take these fruits? Yes, there's a gem under the fruits. There's a knife under the other fruits. Oh, of course it's a curved knife because we're in an Arabic place. Can I open the bag? Yes! Ooh, that was a lovely stab. Key. Key is for lock. Ah, lock has scroll in it. Sure. Right, that's all of our secondaries complete. You wanted to fill the void inside, but it was never enough. And I've got a medallion. Which maybe goes on here? Okay. Oh, and I guess I've got a maze? I do got a maze. What I don't know is where the exit to the maze is. Do any of these look like an exit to you guys? Doesn't look like an exit to me. Oh, I have to fit that in that into there. Okay. Right, okay, I'm with you now. So I need to be I need to be in this hole. Okay. Down. I'm off. Amazing. We've got a crowbar. It's not a tool that I would obviously call a crowbar. I have to admit. Are we gonna smash? Smash? No? No smash? Okay, fine. Um, can we do anything with these bananas? No, I don't think so. Can I pry these plates off? What's the crowbar for? What else is interactable? Only the... Once again, I could just crowbar open the door, but uh... My, my 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 suspicion is that's not in the spirit of things. Tesco, I had to do some cleaning so that my dice won't be kicked with dust when I play D and D tomorrow. Fair enough. I'm still very jealous of you if you have in person D and D. I didn't realize you did. I thought you only had virtual D and D. 
I group all these up? No. Am I supposed to... Is this the combination to that combination mark? D, M, P, X, backwards G? D, M, P, no, there's, there's too, too few. Okay, so I guess that mum just doesn't exist. We, I seem to have solved the puzzle, but I'm not quite sure how I solved the puzzle. <laughs> I don't know what the crowbar's for. <laughs> um, I can no longer interact with anything. I guess I've just got a, I guess I've just got a crowbar now. <laughs> uh, that could literally have been the first thing I did, because that combination lock and the combination were both visible straight away. <laughs> I don't know what the point of the puzzle was. <laughs> okay, Indian throne. <clears throat> Oh dear. Okay, big shield. Can I have, please? No, I can't, but I can have something behind it. Okay, no sign of the other secondaries just yet. What have we got? We've got a grate in the floor, which I don't know what it does. I can't interact with those yet. Lid? Oh, both of our other secondaries together. It's time to make a choice. We give up or continue on your endless search. Well, of course we keep going. Have you never played a game before? Ah. Oh. Blue diamonds. Another blue diamond. Is the blueness of the diamonds significant? Is there a slot for the diamonds? Not obviously. They don't look like they go in there. I assume they don't go on there. They don't look like they go up here, but there is another twiddly bit. Hello. Can I twiddly you? Yes. Oh, purple diamond. Okay. The colour of the diamonds does mean something. Oh, look. More twiddly bits. Another blue diamond. Not another blue diamond. Okay, we've got five diamonds. What do we do with them? I don't think they fit in here. This obviously does some sort of interesting sliding thing. Can I just pull back the curtains? Oh, I can. Okay, I was waiting for something that would pull the curtains back for me. Oh, that's an elephant figure in it. I thought that was like a little, a little dead mouse or something. <laughs> oh, okay. I guess it's a, it's a illuminate all of the things puzzle, probably. Luckily, not too tricky of an illuminate all the things puzzle. We now have a flower. Oh, do the diamonds go in here? Oh, okay. And I can move them around to an unknown end. Where do we think the flower goes? Oh, the flower goes in the top here. Marvellous. Ah, okay. 
So as we move that, like that, no, maybe, I don't really know. God, the, the properties of this pink diamond are, are immense. <laughs> it's able to, to refract light to the blue diamonds, no matter where the blue diamonds are in the world. <laughs> Alright, we did it. Twenty one. Follow the light. Ooh. That's some slightly concerning noises. Oh, I think this is the blue diamond bonus level, isn't it? Maybe? Not sure. Okay. Oh, hello. I tried to click on that and it didn't like it. Oh, it's a sliding puzzle. And it's a sliding puzzle at a really annoying angle as well. Um, great. Just what I wanted. Nope, I want that. How do I get that? Answer, I don't, I don't think. Oh, I hate sliding puzzles! Who thought this was a good idea? Answer me! Tell me! Which evil human being wanted this? I have no idea how to do sliding puzzles. That seems to be working alright though. Well that connects! I assume that's what I've got to do. Just because the devs evidently... Oh this one's even worse! Um, part of the problem is I never know how to get something out of where I want to be. Like, how do I how do I get this in there when there's that in there? You know, um. No, I've got no idea what I'm doing. Uh, right, what do I need? I don't know, is the answer. I have no idea what I need. I hate sliding puzzles. Then this is a particularly mean sliding puzzle, because you don't even know which parts you need. Because, like, this one, I only needed, like, half the parts. Oh my god. Also, the, the noise from this gem is, is slightly maddening. Okay. Think about it, Dizzy. What I need is these two to be out of the way, for one thing. Just get those out of the way. Marvelous. Okay. Then I need to set up a cycle somehow of bits in the right place, which I don't know how to do. Because I, I don't know how to do sliding puzzles to get things in the. I don't know how to rearrange puzzles to get one bit to where I want it. It's, I assume it's the same kind of brain power that Rubik's Cubes use, and I can never do Rubik's Cubes. Um, hang on. What I need to do, I need to get... This one. 
there, I think. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, I, I, I just don't have a brain, which is really unfortunate. I need to get that. And I need to be able to cycle these round, but I can't do that. So, something like this? Nope, this is back where we were before. This is worse. Well, that looks kind of promising. Okay. Now I need to get this to swap with that. I've got no idea how I do that. At all. None whatsoever. How do I get this out of here? <laughs> um. Hang on, right. No, this hasn't helped at all. <laughs> um. Think, Dizzy. Engage that brain of yours. What do I need? I need... Uh, I, uh. How do you do this? How is this a thing that people do? I just cannot for the life of me. I don't know how to get this out of where it is. And... And... Keep... Thing, other things where they're supposed to be. It doesn't make sense to me. Conceptually. Okay, now all I have to do is, is juggle this one to there. I still don't know how to do that, but that's all I have to do. Everything else is in the right place. The problem is, that means I can't move anything else. And I need to, somehow, move everything else. Hang on, okay, I need to, I need to think about this. So I need to get... Oh. No, I've got no idea. I've got no idea. I think I do this? Like that? Well, okay. These are both now connected, but they haven't done anything. Which I'm a little miffed about, if I'm honest with you. Oh, we've got a diamond. We've got another scroll. See, so you've chosen a new, brighter path. What's been done can never be undone. Thanks, I didn't choose anything, actually. But okay. Oh, there's the bar that goes across the middle. Okay, that's how we get that together. Check says sliding puzzles are so rough. I still couldn't really tell you what I did right there. Handle and the battery. Can I pluck the harp? No, okay. Oh my god, I've got no idea what's going on here. Do I put the diamond in this? No. Do I put the handle in this? No. Do I put the handle on that? Also no. Okay. Um. Oh, the handle goes on here. Okay. Oh, it's actually two harps. I see. It's an electric harp. Right. Good. What has that done? Exactly. Do I put the ba the diamond in it? No. Um. Ah. 
Is there a missing slot around the base that the diamond needs to go in? No, okay. Now what? Can we play Freebird on the harp now? I do not think so. Not least because I don't actually know how to play any musical instrument, let alone harp. Although a harp would be a really cool musical instrument to learn how to play. Hmm. What does this star shape give me? What does it tell me? Hmm. What's this? What's it do? What's this? What's it do? Oh! Oh, that moves. Really, really annoyingly. Ah, oh, okay. This is a saw, apparently. Okay, there's a slot for a diamond. Right. Good. Of course, yes. Ah, okay. Oh, oh. Oh, that's pretty. I don't know what I do about it, but it's pretty. Ah, I've got to make a five-point star, I guess? So that's a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine-point star? That's an oval. That's a seven-point star? Yeah, okay. That's a three-point star. That's got five points to it, but it's not quite a star. That's less like a star. That's not at all like a star. That's very much like a circle. I think that's the way we came. Okay. Interesting. That's the five points we're after. Just need to figure out how to turn this into a star. I don't really understand what's sort of going on here. I assume I need to turn this into a five point star. I don't know. It has snapping points, so there's a finite number of things I can try. This is a five point circle. Hmm. I don't really understand. Maybe I need to go back to the pointy shape? Which one was the pointy shape? Not that one. Do I just need to try every combination? That's kind of close! That's a five point star! Okay, amazing. I have no idea why that did what it did, but it did. <clears throat> we broke it! I think that's good. Transfer says it's maths in it. I didn't feel like I was doing math. <laughs> Put it that way. Alright. Oh, hello! We got a cutscene! 
Hey, kitty! <gasps> Shiny sunrise! Do we finally get to pet the kitty? I don't think we have hands. Hello! Hey there! Hey! I briefly got to pet the kitty. Oh, and we also have the choice to embrace darkness. Oh! It does feel a little bit runescape he doesn't it? Okay. So, I'm having a brief little glance around if I can see the scroll. There's the scroll. May you find what it is that you're seeking in the darkness, but be prepared to pay the price. Oh, yeah, I did find what I wanted, actually. It was a key. Oh, it's another one. And this is apparently a screw. Which I suppose we have to screw in. Oh, and then evaporate. Okie dokie, a chest of drawers. We can find our evil socks and our evil underpants. Oh, <laughs> they've got more keys in them. Square tool, medallion, and then the numbers one through eight with attached colours. Can I move that at all? No, okay. Right. And then we have an iron cage of evil. Oh my god. Okay, so this is telling me what number I need to to press on each colour. So one is this sort of turquoise. Turquoise, indigo, army green. Which one's turquoise? Oh, I just pushed the button. Is that turquoise? Do we think? Is the combination so far away from the lock? Um, the chance this is another skirtle that's done to be made heat up. No, that's true. Jasko thinks I'm looting the wardrobe of a cleric. Okay, so I think this is one. Then indigo is two. I mean, I'm only assuming that, that that's what these are. I don't actually know that for a fact. They don't obviously correspond to numbers, so maybe they're not. And then we have this. Oh, I, I, I changed something. Oh, okay, right. Okay, okay, so I gotta make all of these green and all of these white, and I flip a row or a column at a time. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Sh sure? Oh no, I don't flip a row or a column at a time. I don't know what these do, actually. They don't seem to make much sense at all. Oh no. Okay, so I flip pair. And then pair, and then pair, and then pair? Oh, this is horrible. Well, I've got no idea. None whatsoever. <laughs> um. No, wait, this one does just flip all of them. Oh, whose idea was this? For a puzzle! You can at least tell me what I'm supposed to be doing. Josh says, looks like they moved the direction of the arrow. 
and wrap around. Yeah, but like, how? <laughs> like, these two arrows don't do anything. Oh, I see what you mean by move around. Oh, oh, okay. I, okay. Oh, right. They move, I'm not flipping things. I'm just moving the balls. Oh, that was so not clear. <laughs> okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, so it's a sliding puzzle. <laughs> We've established it's a sliding puzzle. Right, well that's very nearly done already, to be honest. Um, somehow I suspect that very nearly done will not translate nicely into actually about to be done. Uh hmm. Hmm. Oh god, okay. Um That nearly worked. Um Hang on, get that out of the way. That back down there. Then, what do I need to do? What do I need to do? I don't know. Put that on there. Do that. Move that. No, move that up. Then move that. Then move that down. Okay, right. Transfer says everything is sliding feels just like everything is security is flawed. And that this helps me how? Exactly? <laughs> I still don't know what the square tool does. I don't seem to have an obvious place to... Oh, the square tool opens this. Never mind. Ah, okay. This is another... This is another part of that puzzle. Oh my god. What? What? Please tell me this helps. Okay, right. Wonderful. Okay, so this is telling me... Oh, God. This is so many... Okay, so one is turquoise, and turquoise I have to do... The little left hand facing thing. I'm going to hit so many buttons by mistake. Two is, is dark purple, which I think is this one. It's a bit, it's a bit unclear to me because these two colors, two and seven, are almost the same. And then neither of them is is dark blue, which is one of the color options. Neither two nor seven is this color. But I'm going to assume they'll be in, in nice numerical order. They're not, but I'm going to pretend like they are. So two is... Maybe two is the dark blue? I really can't tell. That goes indigo thingy pink. That's definitely not in numerical order. Okay, right. We'll assume that two is dark blue, even though it's not actually dark blue. And then two. This is an evil puzzle. Two, we need to do the four in a little propeller plane thing. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, and thank you so much to Curly Tuts for the follow. I actually had no idea you weren't following already, but thank you so much. Right, and then three is khaki green. So it says, oh, there's all kind of lighting effects going on. No, it does not. Three is khaki green, and khaki green is six in a star. Is that khaki green? I guess it must be. Okay, well, that's six in a star. Right, four is light green. And light green is one at the top. Oops, five is pink. And pink is three in like a little hazard symbol. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was already that one. That's nice. Radioactive. Yes, exactly. Oh my god. Okay, right. Six is red. Like, vibrant red. And six is two on the left-hand side. Red is two on the left-hand side, I should say. That's that one. Seven is the other purple, and seven, uh, other purple is two up and down. I'm thinking that's this one. Oh, I'll only use that one, okay. And eight is orange, and orange is two on either side. Okay, amazingly, despite despite everything, that seems to have worked. All right, we've now got some squares. Sure, slot the squares in. Oh, everything's shaking and I can't move. Okay. Other square. Goes in. Okay. Amazing. We've unlocked the, the black cube of evilness. And I assume we've opened the gate. Hooray! Alright. Hey, kitty. I hope you're not mad at me for being evil. Are you summoning corn? I don't think so. I don't really know. Alright, I guess we get the same cutscene with the kitty? Again? Question mark? Oh, did the sun set like that last time? I really don't remember. I don't think it did. Okay, we did it. We've done all of chapter one. I'm not particularly feeling going on to chapter two. Uh, and we've only got like 20 odd minutes left. I guess I'll have a look and see if chapter 2 feels meaningfully different in any way. Congratulations, you murdered the sun. I'm assuming it's going to be a lot harder. Oh, okay. Yeet that again. Having more does not stop you from wanting more. Oh, a winding key and a very pretty picture of a bird. Can I open this drawer? I can. A different key, a non-winding key. This is the Mona Lisa. Which just... Just screw that, I guess. Okay, who needs the Mona Lisa, am I right? <laughs> Transfer says more sliding puzzles. I might cry. Alright, we've got this. This is what the gear is for. That unlocks this handle. Because we we obviously couldn't have just slid that across with our finger. Okay, this little sort of ornithoptery type thing opens up. I'm assuming the winding key doesn't go in there. 
No, okay, that's a doll. Wonderful. Uh, can I take this kettle? Ah, there's a gem inside the kettle. Marvellous. We need those. I actually need another one of those, if you've got one for me, Gain. Uh, where do we think the winding key winds? Well, that's where the puppet goes. Oops, hold on. It's a Ben plushie. Interesting. Oh, okay. I wind him on, and that gets his arms and legs into position. I think we've opened the door. Okay, we've opened the door. We still haven't found the other gem. I think. Again, the game doesn't actually tell you, so it's a bit difficult to find out. I mean, I didn't actually check if there were two gems in this level. I could be wrong. Shall we go through the door and find out? Cheska says, who's making these convoluted doors? I think the doors are a metaphor. Uh, I think the doors are like the cat leading us on to like being a better person, question mark? Oh no, we did. What was the other gem? I do not remember picking up the other gem. Anyway, okay, it looks like the rest is sort of more of the same. And all of the levels so far have been very nice to look at. It's very pretty. As puzzles go, like, it's it's kind of probably the right challenge level for me most of the time. Like, there's stuff that I think is hard, there's stuff that I think is easy, so it's probably pitched about right for me. Um, I'm unlikely to play this ever again, but if it has appealed to you, it's currently free on the Epic Games Store, if that's your jam. Uh, don't go anywhere just yet, those of you who is watching because I'm going to send us off on a wee little raid now. I know we are ending up a little bit early, but I didn't particularly fancy just going on and on and on, doing kind of kind of the same stuff over and over without, without any variation. I think it'll just make me bored, if nothing else. Uh, let's have a look and see who is live. Oh, we have, we have lots and lots of lovely humours to choose from. Uh... We have Lamadia is doing Pokemon, Skylord Zoe is doing Resi 4, Salty is doing Persona 3. Oh my gosh, we, we are we are spoilt for choice in who is live. I think I'm gonna go over and I'm gonna see what, what uh Hannah Lamadia is doing. Is this does this look like a conventional fire red run i don't know maybe let's go say hi to that uh do 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 i think it's, it's crowd control ooh oh yes there's a, a exclamation mark cc in the uh in the thing well let's let's go say hi and maybe you can ruin Hannah's day or something i don't know uh lamania there we go um, don't actually ruin anyone's day. Uh, be wonderful good beans to her as you are to me. Uh, I am so lucky to have you all here. Oh my gosh, 11 humans I am lucky to have here. Wow, that's so many of you. Thanks so much for stopping by. And thanks to Kelly Turtz for the follow earlier. Thanks to Trans Rights and Shaka and Curly and Shaskor and Boom Boom. Uh, all for all lovely beans, all of you, for being around in the chat. Jasmine was here earlier. Gloves as well. Uh, I'll be back on Monday with uh, Shaka doing some more bouldering. We are knee deep in Act 2 and doing things in completely the wrong order. So that'll be fun to see. Uh, at some point we, we might do like a really significant backtrack. But not yet, I think. Um, <laughs> in the meantime... Uh, you can find me on my various social medias down in the, the description. You can type exclamation mark Discord uh, in the chat if you want to go join my Discord, uh, which is a new thing that I got set up because we meet, met our last sub goal, and I finally got off my rear end and did that. Uh, you can check out uh, my YouTube channel for my VODs, uh, and if you're watching this on the VOD, hi VODlings, you can drop a like and consider subscribing. Uh, but yeah, I'll be back next week. Until then, I hope you all enjoy your weekend and enjoy your raid. To everyone, bye!